when you come here, your um, sales agent will come with you. He will give you a tour or she of the house. And this is pretty cool. The first thing you got is your um, garage door opener. Let's see. One button opens where you can put your car. The other button opens where you can have your golf cart. here which is gas I've never driven a gas one so we'll see what that's like while we're here that'll make us easier to decide whether we want gas or or um, battery powered yeah yeah and he said it is full and ready to go also back here are two bikes and with the helmets so we'll have to try some of the biking trails while we're here and a nice sink so that's cool you can go and then, of course, over here is a one-car garage, plenty big for my car, but um, I guess you, if it only had this, or if you had two golf carts, you might could squeeze it over and put a golf cart on one side. Oh, yeah. Sound good? Yeah. All right, and then let's go in the front door. Here is the front door. It's got a little screen-in area, which I kind of like, because if you're leaving to go out, and you want to check and make sure there's no alligators outside. You've got your door here and you can know before you do that. I'm going to go ahead and close the doors here. All right, come on in. Welcome to our home for the four nights. This is the Garnet, I believe, which is one of the um, patio villas that they don't have a whole lot of these because of where they have placed the lanai on the back of the house. But let's start out over here. This is an awesome kitchen. I mean, look at this. And they give you a Keurig with all kinds of coffee in here filled up. You can have as much as you want. We've got cups, we've got um, the toaster, got knives, all the plates that you would need. Let's see what else. Plenty of room to put your stuff, glasses, coffee cups. Got a nice microwave up here and a gas oven. I have never had a gas oven in my life, so I will see if I can cook on it over here. Let's see, more cabinet space. More cabinets. I'm loving all the cabinet space. Got drawers. More. Oh, these cabinets have drawers in them also. That is nice. You got the um, corner cabinet. It could use a lazy Susan, in my opinion. We've got drawers over here, and these drawers are my favorite. I have them in my um, kitchen. And it's great to put your pots and pans in, or anything you really want. Got a nice sink and dishwasher. And then, come around this side, here is the countertop that you can sit and eat at this countertop. It's actually counter height, which I like the best because I don't really like it when they do the step up to bar height. I like just the flat. How about you, Steve? Yeah, that makes it more usable. Yes and also easier to clean. Got a place here for a dining room table. Plenty of room. If you wanted to have a big party here and you had a table that had more um, leaves, you could make it wider and have plenty of room to have a big party here. Nice Thanksgiving, Christmas, Easter, anything. Over here is the patio for the patio villa. I'll let you just take a look out here. And we are on the corner, so we have a little extra room out here than I think a lot of the patio villas do. Let's see. You've got a nice um, living room area here. It just feels so big in here because everything is together and it's got very high ceilings, which are really nice. And this is the one patio villa that has the rear um lanai and let's go on out here they say they have this on this one because it's good for 
the view, a which view. a lot of patio villas don't necessarily have this good of a view. Lake across the street. Yep. And mm. since it does have a good view, they're using it. Nice chairs out here also. And it's nice because you can be out there and not get the bug after you. All right, let's go into the front area again, which this, as you come in the front door, you've got, to the right, you've got the air handler room with lots of extra storage. You could put shelves up in there. That would be nice. And then over on the right hand side is your washer and dryer. Very cool. Then here is the um, guest bathroom. It's got your um, toilet sink. And over here is a bathtub. So if you have little ones, they can actually take a bath, not a shower, if they want to. All right, and then as we come this way, to your left is the door to the garage. So you don't even have to go out the front door if you're getting into your car to go somewhere. It's got panel, your electrical cool panel. access. Oh yes. All that in the garage. Yep. And then over here is the second bedroom. This is the um, guest bedroom. It's plenty of room for, I'd say this is a queen size bed, a couple of side tables, your dresser, and then a good size closet. And they leave hangers and extra sheets for you. So that's nice. And then come on back this way again. This is a long house. I like it. Mm -hmm. And back here is the master bedroom, which is plenty big. You've got, I think we could put a chest drawer in here also and a TV, but this, this is a king size bed. This is big. And around this side is the master bathroom, which I'm really liking with the two different sinks right here. And then over here to the right is the um, linen closet, which is very large. Then we've got a nice shower and it's easy step in. So you don't have to lift your leg up high or anything. Plenty of places to put your soap and conditioner and shampoo and all that good stuff. And then over to the left is your walk-in closet. Your walk-in closet. My walk-in closet. <laughs> and they also have a, um, a Iron and board and iron here, extra pillows have a, oh, what's this say? It says, welcome, enjoy this complimentary bag while you're exploring Florida's friendliest hometown and enjoy it upon your return home, the villages. Cool. And if you were a clean freak and you wanted to clean while you're here, there's even a vacuum cleaner. I doubt we'll be doing that. <laughs> and then this, I like about this model because your toilet has its own private area. You can be in the toilet, shut the door, and you are not going to be messed with. <laughs> so if one person needs to take a shower, but the other person needs to go to the toilet, it's good to go. All right, let's see what they also put on here. The villages, the time is always right to do what is right. May all your dreams come true. Woohoo! Are our dreams coming true, honey? Hopefully. Hopefully. Yours are. <laughs> <laughs> and they even have a real phone here. 